privilege to carry everything to God in prayer. Oh, what peace we often forfeit. Oh, what needless pain we bear. All because we do not carry everything to God in prayer. Have we trials and trouble anywhere, do we never be discouraged, take it to the Lord in prayer, can I find a friend so faithful, who will all our sorrow share, Jesus knows your every weakness, take it to the Lord in prayer. the Lord of care, precious Savior, still our refuge, take it to the Lord in prayer, do thy friends devise forsake thee, take it to the Lord in prayer, in his arms he'll take and shield thee, thou wilt find us all the same. Blessed Savior, Thou hast promised, Thou will all our burdens bear. We may ever bring them to Thee, all into Thee in earnest prayer. Soon in glory, blood and clouded, there will be no need for prayer. What a friend we have in Jesus. Think about that. How many times do we forget to take something to the Lord in prayer and we just worry and worry and worry over it? Kind of like what's going on in this old world today. Everybody's worried about coronavirus. Everybody's worried about hate and fighting and carrying on. Could you imagine what would happen if all of us would just take a little bit of time every day slip off by herself in our little prayer closets, get down on our knees, and pray about these things. Just take a few minutes every day. I challenge everybody out there that hears this video today, take a little time today and every day for the rest of this month and just put it aside to pray for nothing but our nation, for the healing of our nation, and not just the not just the illness that's going on with the coronavirus, but the sin that's in our nation. Pray for our nation that we will turn back to following God and all the rest of the things will just fall in place because the Bible says, put you first the kingdom, seek you first the kingdom of heaven and all other things will be added unto you. So if we'll take everything to the Lord in prayer and put him first in everything that we do, and we'll all take just a few minutes every day for the rest of this month. It don't matter what time of day it is. Just take a few minutes. Get off by yourself and earnestly seek God and pray for our nation. 
we'll watch watch the coronavirus disappear. You'll watch all the hatred and all this deceit and all these lies that the media keep pushing off on us. All that stuff will start to disappear. Why? Because we put God first again. Simple. I guess I'm just simple-minded. I don't know. But, you know, it's, it's, it's a good thing that we've got a, a friend in Jesus that we can go to. And we don't have to have a care in this world. I'm, I'm very thankful for that. He's my friend, and I'm leaning, leaning on him. I hope you guys all have a great day. I hope you'll smile and share, share a little something with everybody. Share this video with everybody. We'll get everybody praying for this nation. There'll be great things happen. You know it? Because we'll all have a friend in Jesus then, and it's, it's, that's what it's all about. I love y'all. I hope you have a great day. Keep smiling. I know I'm early this morning, but I couldn't stand it. I had to get in here and do this song. It was on my heart since I got up this morning. So y'all be good. I'm going to go in here and read the Bible a little while. I'll talk to you soon.